everyone! Today I'm going to be making a classic scalloped potato. So what I've done is I've prepared two large potatoes. I've washed them and then I sliced them into thin slices. And then I also peeled and I sliced a large onion so that as well they are the same width as the potatoes. And then I have all my ingredients ready. I'm going to start off by making a cream sauce and then I'm going to show you how I'm going to layer my scalloped potatoes. So let's get started. I'm going to turn my heat up to the highest heat and I'm going to start off by melting some butter. Once the butter has come to a melt, I'm going to start adding in my next ingredients. The butter is now all melted and now I'm ready to put it in my next ingredients. So I'm going to put some 5% cream. You could also put milk. I'm going to put some 35% cream, which is a, a thicker cream. And then I'm going to let these two come to a boil and then we're going to put in our next ingredients. Now that the creams have come to a boil, I'm going to add some black pepper. A bit of salt. I'm going to turn my heat down now because the creams are now fully boiling and it's rising. So we're going to turn down the heat a little bit and we're going to stir in those items all together. We're going to add some garlic powder. You may also use minced garlic, works just as nice. And we're going to continue stirring that in. I'm now going to gradually add some flour to thicken the sauce. And I'm going to stir that around and let it come to a, a full boil once again. Now that our cream sauce has come to a full boil, I'm going to turn the heat off and I'm going to go on to setting the layers for the scalloped potatoes. So I have a small to medium sized glass dish and what I'm going to do is I'm going to first start off with a layer of the potatoes. So I'm just going to make sure that it's a nice full layer covering the base of the container. And then I'm going to add in the next layer which will be onions. I'm going to consistently um, put the potatoes and then the onions. And then after I do that, I'm going to put a bit of Parmesan cheese in between as well. So I'm on my last layer now, which I've done a layer of potatoes, a layer of onions, and then Parmesan cheese, and then another layer of potatoes, onions, Parmesan cheese, and then now I'm doing my last layer as the potatoes, and then I'm going to be putting uh, some Parmesan cheese, and then now the sauce that I made earlier, I'm going to pour it on top and let it go through all of the layers of the scalloped potatoes. So it's still warm, which is great, so we're just going to layer potatoes nicely, making sure there's a nice balance. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to cover it and I'm going to put it in the oven. I set the oven at 375 and I'm going to first bake them in the oven with the tin foil. And then at the end, I'm going to turn my heat up to broil so I can crisp the top. Once that's done, I'll show you what it looks like. The scalloped potatoes have been cooking in the oven for about 20 minutes. It was first covered with the tin foil, then I took the tin foil off and then I increased the temperature to a broil. 
So this should be done right now. So they're nice and crispy. They are boiling. So that means that the potatoes are fully complete and they're nice and ready to eat. If you like this recipe and you want to see more like this, please subscribe to our channel. Hit that share, like, and that bell notification.